Hello everyone, welcome to my channel once again, Zers here. Hello. Like I told you on the last episode, I farmed affinity with all the characters. And uh, I will do something that I hadn't thought of doing. But before I explain anything, let's play the intro. Guys, as you can see, for example, Alexa, as everyone knows, it's already maxed out, but for example, Elf, Hope, as you can see, Laun is an exception because it's no, it's no, it's not here anymore. Gwyn, as you can see, I got affinity with all the cards. And that took a lot of time, it was boring. I was healed and it's been some time... Uh, that I didn't um, say that I doing didn't do any videos. Uh, when I was doing that, uh, at the end, I, uh, I thought now I'm ready to do videos and do definitive missions. But I thought of a problem. Oh yeah, now that they have uh, a definitive and uh, their definitive maxed out, they will be on their places to do the heart to heart. And uh, for not uh, have the problem or always changing time to trying to find them because especially some of the hearts to hearts they are available anytime I decided to do some small episodes where we see all the hearts to hearts for the characters and this is something I never done like I told you I think I have done one or two for Elma one time because I was searching for her and uh, she was in their place to the heart to heart and I have saw that heart to heart but um, for the other ones I don't know what to expect and uh, we already have done Alexis on the on the let's play so I decided to do the, um, the rest of the characters for the affinity farm like I showed you on the last episode I went to the support missions and I have done the water torture uh, level 50 as, as you can see on the right side uh, on the third uh, window grow a lot closer to the party members <sighs> and like I, I told you I saw how many missions you hit uh, we needed to do to go from one uh, uh, heart to another and uh, how many is in total as you can see, for the one heart, you need a three. Uh, you need to do that mission three times. For uh, going from uh, one heart to two hearts, you need to do four more. From two to three, seven more, and so on, so forth until five. So, if you don't have any affinity with, with a character, you need to do that mission twenty-eight times in a row. To max it out at five hearts or 21 if you only want four this is usually what i've what i always done because i don't think there's any affinity mission that requires five hearts but because i thought um, about the hearts to hearts problem i said to me okay let's go with the five i have done the five for the first uh, for the first three only to know how how many missions uh, we needed and I ended up uh, doing that for all the characters uh, I'll let a link for uh, this image on the description like uh, I usually do when I do when I do some of the of those images so guys let's start and uh, the first character that we will do is Elma and uh, like I said before, I'm, uh, I'm uh, seeing the, um, the game fact guide for Heart to Heart because I really don't know where they are, like I said before. The link is already in the description a long time, since uh, Alexa's I think. So you can go to see there. So apparently, for the first Heart to Heart, we need to go to the industrial di district in the afternoon. So before going there, let's go change the time. And I don't think we, we have been here uh, a lot of times to change the time inside the barricades. 
it's right over here So, afternoon. And uh, let's go to the gamepad. Industrial district, and apparently is near the west gate. And west gate, uh, if I'm not mistaken, is over here. Oh, we don't even need to search. We already got the info somewhere. That's perfect. So, you already know where we need to go. We uh, fast travel. Uh, let's go to the fast travel so the info will be displayed. Oh, it was taking a, a little time the the fast travel. So we teleport to the central industrial district and is right north. So let's go. See what Helm has to say. So she should be around here to the north. Uh, so she should be around here. Is, is she there? Oh! I found her! <coughs> and we have new infants to get. Let's see what she has to say, guys! Expanded the effective area of the deflector shields will require optimizing our energy output by at least 80%. The only way to accomplish that is by multiplexing our energy drivers. Alright, I'll prepare a couple of designs proposals. You can bring them to the mechanical team and see which they think is the most workable. Oh, hello there Zers. Sorry about that. I was wrapped up in the conversation about technical issues with the new LA's defenses, which you heard. Anyway, I didn't even notice you You were there. Express admiration for El Elma's many talents, show concern that Elma is pushing herself too hard. I kinda want to worry, but I, sh I really should praise her. Oh, uh, that? Oh, it's nothing. I did a little bit of mechanical engineering work years ago, but it hardly qualifies as one of many talents. Uh, I'm not so sure, Elma, but okay. Honestly, outside of engineering, combat is my only noteworthy talent. I can't even cook like Lin. Yeah, apparently no one can cook like Lin, Elma, so don't worry. So, I'm determined to see what the few talents I do have... I do have put in the best possible use for new LA. I hope you, too, can avoid being constrained by the const constant demands of Blade. And can put our other talents to use now that now and then for the good of new LA. Say that you aspire to lead just such a life. Say that you serve new LA best by focusing on Blade. Mm. Yeah, Blade is really important, but uh, is not the only thing important. Like we said in one of the missions, th I know that there's an answer we need to do, or we need to give that we gave uh, that. Uh, that uh, no work is as is as as small or big as to me. All it's all the same or something like that. So I'll agree. I'm glad you understand. If every, if any uh, if everyone uses their unique talents to help everyone else out, I know we'd be able to survive our current travels. And beyond that, we'll be we'll be better positioned to build a bright future for all of us here in New LA. Then we Blade could truly say that we're building a legacy. You completed Elma's heart to heart, the techie. Okay, techie. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. So, the next heart to heart, apparently, is on the residential, you know, the residential district. Ismael Hills is around here. Is it it? Oh, I know it. This is fog. Ismael Hills and we need uh, to be at night and we need a, pe uh, a pet cat that you already had I have so let's teleport before to deliverance part because we need to change the time uh, 
And he's saying that he's uh, 5x no uh, north from uh, Ismail Hills. Really? So at which point will it be? Because if he's north from the map, is it around here? But if it was the case, he wouldn't say it's Mile Hills. Uh. Like I told you guys, I really don't know. So mm, let's go to this Mile Hills. If not, I will need to go... Here? See elsewhere exactly where it is. As you can see on the mini-map, there's some white dots. This is the place where people are. So we can use that at least to know where pe uh, where people are. Mm. I think I'll need to go search exactly where it is. Because if he, because it's saying it's a uh, five hex north, so five axes are the um, the axes on the on the gamepad. Well, guys, I think I'll go try to search. Uh, somewhere else because the thing is from the Ismail Hills uh, fast travel point 5 axes will be will already be near the station there so I don't see you if that's the case why they why they would speak about the um, the Ismail Hills. By the way. Yep. Because five will be around here already. Hey. Uh, uh, guys, I'll pause the record uh, very quick, and I try to. To go see exactly where um, the heart to heart is. That let's see because we got uh, no, we got some information on the gamepad, but nothing about uh, Elma. Okay, guys, uh, see you in a bit. I'm back, guys. I found her. I. Uh, they were right, it was uh, 5 squares north from the Ismail Hills. But when I got here and we passed it here before Elma was not here. Because uh, like I said, one of the prerequisites was a pet cat. And uh, uh, I went to the barricades, to the um, barricades customization. And the pet uh, I had chosen at the time was a dog. So that's why it didn't activate. When I changed it to um, to a cat, Elma appeared. I didn't know that, and uh, I was really lucky to thought about that. I didn't think so. Well, so let's see. Mm -hmm. hmm? What am I doing? I am playing with this cat. I figured that uh, was kind of ob obvious. Do I not seem like uh, an animal loving type to you? Believe it or not, I had a pet sim CMEs on Earth. On my days off, she would crawl onto my lap and let me stroke her chin while I enjoy the good book. Petting cats always reminds me of life on Earth. 
What about you? Does interacting with pets remind you of anything? Uh, say it makes you respect you ha you had a pet on Earth. Confess it doesn't remind you of anything special. Hmm. Yeah, not. She doesn't have memory, so I don't know. Ah, <sighs> your face uh, lights up when you talk about pets. Such a powerful reaction to a lost memory. I wonder if that means it's actually a returning memory. Mm. Do you think pets could serve as a trigger to recovering your, your other lost memories? Mind if I ask you another question, just as a matter of personal curiosity. What animal do you think makes the best pet? Uh... <laughs> Sorry guys! Oh gosh! I wasn't expecting this! Cats, dogs, or Elma? Uh, I really want to choose this one. I really want to choose this one. Let's choose this one. That's interesting. You know I'm not a pet, right? So why on earth will you even say that? <laughs> oh gosh! I really wasn't expecting this, but okay. Perhaps this is another symptom of the damage or maybe some suffer in the crash. Yeah, hey, Elma, I really, I really think that should be the case. I'll make an appointment for you at the Mimiosome Maintenance Center and request they perform a disassembly so they can analyze your components. Whoa, 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 Elma. Calm down, calm down. Oh, don't worry. It's a routine procedure for uh, severe mental damage. I'll personally make sure that they do a true job of cleaning up your skull. <laughs> oh, but she like it! <laughs> okay, next one. Uh, commercial, no, commercial district. Uh, East Mobile Street, one next North East, then one next South Morning. Oh gosh, I'm a normal person. I feel bad myself, but I really... Like I said guys, I have never done this. Uh, center mobile uh, street, uh, it should be... No way east. It's this one? No. Okay. After that we will teleport there, but before that we need to change the time. Oh, go oh gosh, this game has, uh, has such surprises sometimes. So, we need it to be morning. I'm an Elba person, oh gosh. If any of you guys uh, have done this for the first time and went to that uh, answer, please let me know what you thought about that. I'm really curious because, uh, I, I, like I said, that was a big surprise. Okay, so apparently she should be around there. Uh, so Elma found you. Ow. Oh, hello. Hosers, what a coincidence! Are you interested interested in cars? Some hot. Say that you're a, a real gearhead. Confess that you don't really care about cars. Hmm. I don't say a really a real gearhead, but I like it. I expected as much. There's a cling in your eyes that I recognize from another car lover I know. I'm hardly an expert on the topic myself, but I know enough to poke around under the hood. It reminds me how that friend of mine used to use all kinds of crazy car jargon when he drove me around in his classic car. Oh! If you say so, Elma? White walls, glass tanks, supercharged Hemi, rock and pinion steering, stuff like that. His car was really old-fashioned and it, uh, it stalled all the time. But I think that gave me an appreciation for the history of the automobile. Made me feel like cars were more than just a bunch of bolts and metal. Boast that your, your first car was a steam-powered. Suggest to take Elmo for a ride once you buy a car. Yeah. <coughs> Sounds great, but first we have to bring back the classic cars. I wonder if there's enough information about old cards in the life of the archives for us to reproduce them. I know it's hardly feasible now, but let's do what we can to make it a reality someday. That will really be something to look forward to. 
Complete the Delmas Heart to Heart Driving Force. Driving Force. I like. I really like the Heart to Heart name. So the fourth one, Manam Ship. On the evening. So before going to the Manam Ship, let's change the time because I really don't know where on the Manam Ship we can change the time, or even if we can. There should be a place there to change time, but I need to pay attention to that. But now, now that I'm thinking of that, yeah, it should be around, maybe the only place, I don't know anywhere to change the time. On the world map it's kind of different, some of places I already know we can go there, if not, uh, I can see on the map, but on the Manum ship, I really don't know. So, evening. <clears throat> okay. Manum ship. Oh, just before, let me show exactly uh, where we, where I was, commercial district, and uh, she was here. Like as you can see, heart to heart. The nearest fast travel was the East Mobile Street. So now let's go to the Manum ship. And uh, he's saying uh, uh, starboard. I think it's um, the first one, this one, deck, starboard, so it's here, maybe it's it's this one, oh, we, we had the information, so it's perfect, let's teleport, so is Manum ship, starboard, 1x north evening, oh, she's right over there, like we saw before, hello Alma, what are you doing here, Zers? You must enjoy this place as much as I do, huh? It's a beautiful sight, isn't it? So what's catching your eye today? Uh, tell Elmas you're watching the Manum savor their pizza. Tell Elma you're, you're entranced by the beautiful light. Tell Elma you're watching the, Xeno, the Xenoforms interact peacefully. Mm. Uh, I don't. Uh, I kind of don't like the first one. The, the second or the third. But let's put the third. You've noticed it, that's what I've been watching. I wonder if the humans of even a short time ago could have imagined a scene like this. I was aware of the possibility that certainly never imagined it would happen so quickly. Humans are a species that seems able to make friends with anyone. Any people who share a desire to protect something can work together to achieve that goal. It's a basic be behavioral principle, yet uh, one that's entirely f foreign to a group like the Ganglion. And that's why so many different Xenoforms can live peaceful in the human city. When I watch this I feel like it gives me strength. It's a test uh, testament to, of uh, how the power to form bonds can change the world. Friendship? Friendship? Uh, three, ta three ties. Oh gosh. And the parent last one is on the barricades. Interior at night. So let's go to the barricades. I don't, uh, I don't need to show you this one, everywhere, everyone knows where the barricades is, <laughs> we only need to change the time, and she will be, I think, uh, over there, but uh, the, uh, now we can uh, put it in our party, but if, maybe if we, if we change tonight, it should uh, start the... Um, the heart to heart. I'm kinda happy I decided to do the heart to heart, really. Oh, she changed the place. Hello, Alma. Oh, hello, Zers. Sorry about that, I was just lost in thought. Or maybe it's more accurate to say that I was getting a bit sentimental. When exactly did this place become my home? When did I grow to love it so? So many unexpected things have happened, you know. And yet, humanity has begun to lay down roots on this planet in spite of all that. I don't know. Maybe that's why I feel like my perception have changed a little. When I finish the mission and return to the barricades, it really feels like I'm coming home. Tell Elma you feel the same way. Say you don't feel that way at all. Let's agree. It makes me happy to hear that. Did you know that our floor is unique with, within the blade barricades? Our quarters are larger than those of the other teams and also come with the biggest kitchen. I've been blessed to be able to share them with only people I trust completely. 
Nagi and Vandam even allowed me to bring Lin and Tatsu in here, despite her age and his, well, him. Yeah, yeah, him. Oh, I found the cat! Look, he's on the bottom left corner, I didn't even notice that before. It was good to them to make all that happen. Assume that it's, uh, it's due to her rank as a colonel. Ask why Alma was given such special tunes. Well, uh, let's speculate? I don't know. Uh, no, I'm afraid that's not it. Blade has no ranks, not in a practical kind of way. I mean, the only people who really care that I am a corner are Irina and Wynn. Think about it. Would, would you and Lin really want to live under the same roof as someone you had to address as corner, as corner all the time? No, rank means nothing here. Anyway, if we have another opportunity someday, I might tell you more about it. And about me. But for now, we should drop it. I know you're busy enough with, without me taking up all your time. Completed Helma has to heart going home. Perfect. Oh, cat! Get over here! Lin is not here, so she's on the her place for a heart to heart too. Can I pet you? Uh, apparently not. Oh, that's sad. I was hoping so. So, guys! This took uh, way longer than uh, what, what I was expecting. But I, I like it. I hope you guys like it too. Like I said, I left the link for the image on the description, if you want it. So guys, like always, rest well, just out.